On March 15, 2020, America's National Church and Museum suddenly and temporarily closed its doors in response to the pandemic that has taken such a devastating toll in the United States and throughout the world. Today, we are on the cusp of reopening. During the museum's closure, the lights of Christopher Wren's venerable Church of St. Mary the Virgin Aldermanbury, a centerpiece of the museum, have remained on day and night as a constant and consistent reminder that though the galleries may be dark, we look forward to brighter days ahead. The 900-year-old British church, destroyed in the Great Fire of London in 1666, rebuilt by Wren in the 1670s, then badly damaged in the Blitz of World War II before being relocated and rebuilt by Westminster College in the 1960s, is a powerful symbol of steadfastness in the face of adversity. It remains now, like Winston Churchill, a beacon of resilience. While the museum has been closed to the public, staff members have remained at work on important projects, including collections inventory and digitization, ongoing preservation of the historic church, and innovative webcasts to global audiences, including a virtual commemoration of the 75th anniversary of Churchill's The Sinews of Peace speech on March 5th. The museum has invested more than $1.3 million in the ongoing preservation of our landmark building, with even more planned in the months ahead. Now, we are pleased to announce the museum's grand reopening and look forward to welcoming you back to this special place. Thank you for your continued investment in the bright future of our rich history. We look forward to seeing you here soon. <laughs>